Hi, I'm going to show you today how to use AI Contact Safe. First, log in to the back end of your web page with your username and password. And inside the back end, go to Components AI Contact Safe Profiles or click on AI Contact Safe and then go to Profiles. Here, you're going to find the default form. You can add a new one but then everything would be blank so what I do is I copy the default form and many options are already selected so it makes it a lot easier first you're going to want to change the name maybe something like contact us and these options are already selected for you so you don't have to play with that and the CSS dictates what orientation and how centered the information is going to be on the page that's what it's for you want to align the buttons you can just leave them up to the left it's up to you and the captcha will help you uh, keep spam at bay and so it's very important to leave it enabled we'll just make the width of 400 instead of 300 and then you have email address we're gonna make uh, ours info at brotherpages.com which is the page we're on right now so you set it to yours email mode HTML would, will allow them to do bold and italics. That's probably what you want to leave. And mark recoil fields character. It can be an asterisk, for example, or just the exclamation mark. It's up to you. It's just a matter of taste. Here is your information. Some information is already provided, but of course it's not our information. So we want to fill it out with our own information. And this is uh, what our clients are going to read when they go to the contact us form. Just going to fill some information here. You, of course, are going to fill out your own information. Brotherpages.com. Okay, and that's it. You can always use bold or italics and insert an image. There's another video where you can see how I explain to add images. This is the contact information positioning, and uh, that's where this information you just wrote in is going to be. In this page, the contact information is at the top, and the form is at the bottom. So that's what it means when it says top, right, or left side. Finally, this meta description is the explanation or the description of what this page is all about and this is what the search engines will find or read and so you want to fill it out and the keywords are also the words that when somebody looks them up on a um, search engine when they type these pa these words in then they'll be directed to your page and these are already set at, by default if you want this contact form you're doing right now to be the default one, check default. And these are the fields that are required. As you can see, they're all selected. You want to fine tune it, and for example, get rid of this option, then uncheck the all selected and select them all, and then just get rid of the one. Finally, as usual, remember to save your work, and there you go.